Using your iPhone as a webcam requires that you install an app on your phone and some software on your computer. Unfortunately, your iPhone doesn't support this functionality out of the box, so third-party software is required to get it working. There are a few different apps you can use, but we recommend Kynonai's Epoch Cam Webcam. Not only is it easy to set up, but the free version with ads and occasional watermarking works with both Mac and PC. Any iOS device that's running iOS 10.3 or later will work, so even if you have an old iPhone 5 or iPad Mini 2 in a drawer, it'll work. To get started, first download the Epoch Cam app on your iPhone or iPad, then head over to your Mac or PC and visit www.kinoni.com to download the driver for Mac OS 10.12 and later, or Windows, Windows 7 and later. Follow the steps to install and then restart your machine just to be sure it's recognized. Once you're up and running, go back to your iPhone and launch the Epoch Cam app. Don't be worried if all you see is a black screen with an image of a laptop and a phone pulsing circles, that means the app is searching for your computer. Once you launch an app on your computer that supports video, the Epoch Cam app will activate and beam video over Wi-Fi to your computer. For example, if you're using Skype, go to the audio and video settings, and select Epoch Cam from the drop-down menu above the video screen. You can use this GitHub site to test the connection. Mac users can also download the Epoch Cam viewer for Mac to test it. If you're using the free version of Epoch Cam, the video will be limited to 640 by 480 at 30 fps. But you can download Epoch Cam Web Camera for computer for $8 to raise it to 1080p Full HD video. And if you're looking to run more than one stream simultaneously, Epoch Cam Multicam is available for $20. However, you'll need a separate microphone, as Epoch Cam disables it on the iPhone while the camera is running. If you don't see an image when you select the Epoch Cam, you probably just need to launch the app on your iPhone. A few troubleshooting tips. If Epoch Cam isn't listed as an option, try installing the driver again. If it still doesn't work, make sure your iPhone and computer are both connected to the same Wi-Fi network. Also, if you see a black screen with a spinning loading icon in the video window and the iPhone app is open, Try quitting the apps on both your iPhone and computer and relaunching. If that doesn't fix it, try restarting your computer. 